15 says, find the equation of the tangent line to the graph of 3x cubed plus 2x, so a cubic. So a tangent line, the equation of a tangent line, you need two pieces of information. You need a point and a slope. And when I say slope, you should be thinking derivative value, okay? And so first thing is we need, we need a point. So when x is equal to one, when x is equal to one, y is three times one cubed plus two times one. So three times one cubed is three plus two is five. So when x is equal to 1, y is equal to 5. So there's my point. For the derivative, we need to find this, or for the slope, we need to find the derivative. So we need our derivative rules here. So if we, f of x is, um, is 3x cubed plus 2x, then f prime of x is going to be doing the power rule here. So that's going to be 3 times 3 is 9x squared plus 2. So that's my derivative. And now I need my derivative value when x is equal to 1. So we need to find that derivative value at the same location. So for derivative when x is equal to 1 is 9 times 1 squared plus 2. And 9 times 1 squared is 9 plus 2 is 11. So my derivative value is 11. That means my slope is 11. And so now to find my equation of my tangent line, what we need to do is we need to put this in the tangent line equation form. So that is y equals, and then we're going to need to have our slope. Slope value times x minus coordinate plus our y coordinate. So that's going to be then a slope of 11 x minus 1 plus 5 is going to be our equation for our line. And we could stop there for the answer, but I know the answer key is in slope-intercept form, so that would be y equals 11x minus 11 plus 5, which would be y equals 11x minus 6. That's what you're going to see in the answer key, but please stop here. If you don't have to pick an answer out of a multiple choice question, it saves time. Now, it's not a calculator question, but you can calculate the derivative. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So if we go to our y equals, <clears throat> and if we, in our y equals, if we put in the function 3x cubed plus 2x, and there's that function. And let's just zoom standard so we can see it better. There we go, there's our function. And then we can calculate the derivative at one by doing a calc, which is the trace key. It's second trace, which is calc. And we're gonna calculate a derivative, which is a D, option six, dy dx. So option six. And then we're going to type in our x location that we want to find the derivative. So we want to find it at x equals 1. So notice when I type in 1, it says x equals 1 there, and I hit enter. And my derivative value is right there, 11. So I can find the slope value without having to do any calculus and any algebra. So I can get that 11 value from my calculator. I can get this from my calculator, from my table and then I can write this equation directly without any computation.